hello guys welcome back to my channel good morning good afternoon good evening depending on when you see this video if this is your first time clicking on my video or visiting my channel you're welcome please hit the subscribe button and hit this notification bell as well so that you will be informed whenever i post a video also if you are a family member of my channel thank you for stopping by guys we'll be visiting two topics today the first one is actually a very quick one it's a bad and endurance who has been spotted out in public for the first time since the passing of his son at the beginning of november Davido has not been seen in public. He has not made any post or made any public comment since the passing of his son, Ifain, at the beginning of November. But he has just been spotted at the Lagos Fashion Week that is holding in Lagos this week. And that actually gladdens my heart. It gladdens my heart that he's now branching out he's now stepping out in public because he actually took his time to grieve the passing of his son don't get me wrong i'm not saying the grieving process is over because it only happened like what three four weeks ago now the grieving of a loved one the mourning of a loved one is something that happens over an entire lifetime you can never actually stop mourning a loved one but you can have yourself cooped up inside the house as well so that makes me happy that he now finds the strength within him to actually step out in public to actually slowly get back to life as usual to venture because we're not in his mind, so we don't know what's actually happening in there. I cannot say that he has started the healing process, so I can only assume that he is actually at least trying to start the healing process. Going out in public, going back, doing the things that are his norm, are actually going to help in this process. And I'm happy that he's beginning to attempt that he's coming out little by little is being seen in public this is actually very good news in my opinion and i pray that everything that he has lost be replenished and also that he god gives him the strength to continue to put one foot in front of the other and just keep going davido is a strong person he's a strong guy he's been through a lot and he's still standing. I pray that he gets the fortitude to continue to bear the loss of his son. Moving on to the next topic, guys. It's about our beautiful Nollywood actress, Rita Dominic. Rita Dominic and her husband have fixed their white wedding for this weekend in the united kingdom this is not actually surprising though as destination weddings have sort of been a thing lately among nigerian celebrities they fix it they have their traditional weddings in nigeria and then they fix their white weddings outside nigeria they all almost all of them anyway prefer destination weddings and they have only their close pals go with them. So I wasn't expecting anything less from Rita Dominic. The wedding is set to hold in a stately manner in North Yorkshire. And amongst Rita's trains will be Michelle Dede as the chief maid of honor, Kate Shaw, a fellow Nollywood actress, and a longtime friend of Rita Dominic. That's actually her bosom friend. They've been friends ever since, for years now. Also among the three will be Victor Sogunro and Dr. Olivia Waturocha. I hope I promote, pronounce that correctly. Yes, yeah, Waturocha. The wedding is said to be formal and um, 
guests have been advised to add to be dressed the dress code is black and white they have been advised to appear in white and black clothing the couple did their traditional marriage back in april 2022 earlier this year i'm really happy for it at dominic all a lot of people questioned why she stayed single or why she was it in a hurry to have kids so she just seemed uninterested for a long time and in almost every interview she gave she did state that she was not in a hurry to get married and she's one of those women that didn't think you need marriage to be complete you don't need marriage to feel complete marriage doesn't actually complete you she was waiting to actually either find the right person or just live her life it's better to be single than be in a marriage where you constantly have to feel like you're surviving and she waited for a long time actually a lot of people already gave up hope of ever actually seeing her get married and then all of a sudden she announced she was not only engaged but she was having a traditional marriage which actually happened like i said back in april this year and we're really really happy for her that she found that person that made her feel complete that made her feel like she had to rethink her views on marriage or what she thought about it or her stand on it she found somebody that she felt was worth having the journey or the going the journey with we're really really happy for her and i hope with everything in me that um it turns out to be everything that she hopes for or everything that she wishes for herself i wish her rita and her husband fidelis anosiki a blissful wedding and a long and happy fruitful life together well guys that's it for now until i bring the next topic your way don't forget to hit the subscribe button hit the like button comment share this video and above all stay blessed bye